My name's Johnny. <laughs> hey, how's it going, Joker fam? It's your boy, Haha ha Joker, aka the Black Joker, back at it again. Another Madden video for you guys. So, it's your first time checking out one of my videos. First time you even come to the channel, man. Make sure you guys drop a like. And also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, man. We're on the road to 1K. Make sure you guys hit that sub button, man. It's free. It only takes one second. With that being said, we're going to go ahead and jump straight into this. Now, as you guys know, Super Bowl past promo is out. Obviously, they're going to release the rest of the Super Bowl promos throughout the weeks and this, that, and the other. But right now, Super Bowl past promo is officially out. As you guys can see, we have a new currency in the game, the first downs. Now, <clears throat> I'm not going to get into the currencies and stuff like that. Unless, you know, you guys want to see a video on that, then I will make one. But we're, we're talking about the Raiders theme team. So as you guys know, we got a middle linebacker, Corey Littleton. Now, we also have Bruce Irving out in the game, but he doesn't have a power-up. So, and I don't think his car gets Raiders cameras. But you guys let me know that in the comment section below. If he does, if he does, then I'll pick him up. But I, I don't think he does. But um, either way. Like I said, we have Corey Littleton in the game, and on my team, on a Raiders theme team, he's a 98 overall. Forgot I cannot do comparing. I got to keep remembering that, man. I can't do comparing on the team. But um, <clears throat> he's a 98 overall on my team. Seems to be a very good middle linebacker. Now, here's the thing, right? He has, he's a field general archetype, and the good thing about him is that I believe, if I'm not mistaken, his zone's not that bad. If I'm not mistaken, let me see his, yeah, his zone's a 97. So with lockdown, max out, he has a 97 zone coverage, which is very good for a middle linebacker. Now, here's the thing. He can be, you know, a user linebacker. He comes in with 93 speed. So again, not that bad. He comes in with 93 speed. You probably could much rather use a safety, prefer him, but, you know, put lurker on him. You still got a good user. For me personally, when I rock my main team, I will be using him a little bit differently than, you know, putting, actually using him at middle linebacker. You know what I'm saying? So what I mean by that is currently right now, let's just, we'll go through his stats first. How about we do that first? So <clears throat> his stats compared to um, Jerome Baker, um, he has 93 speed. All right. So Raiders team team max out sprinter. He has 93 speed, 95 acceleration, 77 strength, which isn't all that, but 99 tackle, 99 play rec, um, 91 block shit, which isn't bad. He meets thresholds, 94 hit power with a 97 zone coverage. Now, because he's a field general linebacker, he gets mid zone knockout for one AP, if I'm not mistaken. I'll go ahead and check that right now, as a matter of fact. Um... He gets, yeah, so mid zone knockout, he gets it for 1 AP. Now, here's why this is so important. As you guys know, mid zone knockout is like one of the glitchiest abilities you can have if you particularly run a lot of zone coverage, especially having players that can get mid zone knockout for 1 AP. For me personally, what I have started doing in a lot of my weekend league games is that I sub out Khalil Mack and I will put someone like Corey Littleton. Or at the time, before Corey Littleton dropped, I would put um, Junior Say out because he is a field general linebacker. I will replace Khalil Mack out of my rush in and put in Jerome, I mean Jerome, <laughs> Junior Say out at that position. And then I will put him into a hard flat or cloud fat or whatever I want to put him in. And he will react to passes when they're thrown to his zone. He gets a lot of breakups, obviously not that many picks, but... He's just there. You know what I'm saying? He will swap the ball and so on and so forth, With which that's what you want. You don't want these guys who are running these strong close and things like that, that a lot of formations that attack the flats, you don't want them to just continue attacking the flats and there's no repercussion. You know what I'm saying? So I will be using Corey Littleton in that position. Now for this gameplay, he will be playing in the box. I will be using him just to... Kind of see how he works as far as just, you know, the user ring goes. But on my main team, he will be playing that position that Khalil Mack plays. Again, a little bit more detail of what I'm talking about. Khalil Mack will normally stay in if I'm going against someone who does a lot of run plays. Because Khalil Mack has way better block shedding than obviously Corey Littleton and Junior Seau. But for the passing, obviously Khalil Mack doesn't have very good zone. 
Whereas Corey Littleton, Junior Seau, they have better zone coverage. And on top of that, like I said, Corey Littleton having being a field general, he gets mid zone knockout for 1 AP. So he still reacts and gets those glitchy animations to the ball when it's thrown into his zone. So again, guys, we're gonna go ahead, jump to a gameplay. I'll show you guys the stats, I'll show you the abilities he can get. Um as, as it is right now, we're just going to run Lurker on him because honestly, that's all I really feel like he really needs. So we're just gonna run Lurker on him, see how he does, and see if we can ball out with Corey Littleton, man. See how boys in there. All right, Choco fam. So we found ourselves a game going against the Raiders theme team. Um, Sam Mills, Charles Woodson, Rod Woodson, and both those corners have one step ahead, but that's our Raiders theme team. So we'll see how we do. All right, Joker fam. So we're starting out on offense first. I'm going to be skipping. I'm obviously going to be skipping over a lot of my offensive drive since this is a defensive gameplay, but if something dope happens, obviously I'll leave it in. If not, then you'll just probably see me on defense and whether I scored or not. On first and 10. on the keeper but it's going to lead to a fourth down this is caught by Jackson a four yard game on second down you better be quicker than that all right, Joker fam, so we're on defense now, man. No fly zone hitting the field. <clears throat> As you guys can see, we ended up scoring on our drive. And um, right now we have, I'm not usually Maze, but he's obviously in the box. You guys can see him usually Corey Littleton. Um, don't have my zone drop set, so if he gets something over the, don't know how he got that through. But not only am I very surprised that he threw that, I'm very surprised that it got through. So, I mean, hopefully that doesn't happen again. Let's see if we can make something happen. On first down. Hot and hot and so hot. To throw on second down. Gannon. Should have been here. They'll try and throw for it here. Oh my. That's on me. That's completely on me. <sighs> That's the second time my my corners are reacting, but I'm not. I don't know. I'm not getting the. Uh, I'm not getting picks. Not a not a fan of that. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. To throw again. Gannon. And he takes a shot. And he finds the water in the end zone. All right, Joker, we're on offense, man. Um, <clears throat> Very uh, bad defensive drive, but I missed some stuff with my users. I will say that. But he he's throwing it in the coverage. Let's see what CPU reacts to certain passes, and we're just not getting picks. There's only swats, so you know it, it kind of is what it is at this point. But hopefully, it gets better. Hopefully, we get some picks. You know. All right, Joker fam, we're in the second half now. Um, I guys, we're back on no fly zone. As you guys can see, we're we're up right now. Um, I was able to drive down, put some more points on the board. But well, we got to, I mean, we kind of clamping up, but I just got to do better. That's all there is to it. I got to do better. Oh, he's stealing. All right. So we finally got ourselves a pick. All right. Let's go, Waller. Come on now. All right, Joker fam. So we're back on no fly zone. Um, just got to keep locking up again. Um, hopefully, this won't be an... I think we can lock up like this. Okay, no, we couldn't. All right, I, I have to put another cloud flat up. Give me that. Let's go. Got it. Got a user pick. Come on, baby. Come on, Waller, I like it, baby. Yikes. All right, well, 
Hey, man. GG's, bro. All right, Joker fam. So we found ourselves a game. We got a Raiders team team with two one step ahead corners. What else is new? And there goes our team. So see how this goes. All right, Joker fam. So we're starting on no fly zone, man. Hopefully we can get Corey Littleton another pick. That would be, that'd be pretty dope. I'll take that on the first drive. I got stuck on the D line. I'm about to get dotted. It always happens. It always happens. Of course. Alright, see what we can do here this time. Operating from the gun. Gannon. Being chased out left. Now he'll square oh up and my. throw deep. This is caught inside the 15. You got to be kidding. Me. <sighs> this for field position. All right, Joker fam. Uh, all right. I really ain't got nothing to say about that. Good pass, I guess. That's all I can really say. Come on, man. Let's go. All right. All right, Joker fam. So we're on offense now. Uh, homeboy didn't have a very impressive drive, in my honest opinion. But, you know, he scored regardless, so it doesn't really matter. But, again, if his receiver didn't route, bounce off the line or off the sideline and go upfield and he he wouldn't have had that so he got lucky in my opinion but i don't know what's with all these animations all these auto spins i, I don't know what's going on all right joker fam so we're on defense now no fly zone we just gotta lock up and kind of just keep him boxed in, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, we can do that. We'll we'll be sitting pretty, 100%. Kind of disappointed that he's that playmaker that, but hey, we'll take that. So we're going to change something a little bit. We're going to take it with the hard flats, put up cloud flats, and see if we can get, like, somewhat of the same results as far as locking this dude up. He's going to try to reroute. Couldn't get anything. All right. That's all we want to do, man. See, that's one thing I will say is that I can tell homeboy is looking to for the reroutes and uh, is that and the he's not going to keep running around like he's Vic out here. You know what I'm saying? Homeboy's got Rich Gannon, and he's out here trying to – he's out here just trying to do too much. And that's not, that's not going to help him. You hear what I'm saying? And, of course, he has – he has a delayed fade. It is, it's funny, bro. All right, Joker fam. So as you guys can see, we're in the second half. We came away with three right before the first half ended. Our goal right now, we got to get we gotta get a touchdown. You know, very simple. We, we got to find a way to um, get, get in the end zone, bro, and pretty much give this kid a run for his money. Because as it is right now, he, he's not doing anything. In my eyes, he's not doing anything impressive. He's waiting for the CPU to reroute so he can get something glitchy with the computer, and he's going to delay phase, which which tells me all of his other routes are boxed up if he has to go to delay phase. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, that's what we need to look for, and that's what we need to just take away. If we can take away those things, then we're chilling. You know what I'm saying? We ain't got nothing to worry about. All right, Joker from Run No Fly Zone. We just, like I said, we just have to take away what we know he wants to go to. So we know that's taken away. We just got to play that. Hot and hot and so that's hot and hurt. As we already know what he's looking for. All right, so homeboy's coming out and gum bunch again. All right, so this time he has no other reads picked off. Easy. Easy money. We know what he wants to do. Just take it away. That's it. We're chilling. You gotta be kidding me. I, yo, yo, EA's trying me. I'm not gonna lie. EA's really trying my patience right now. EA's really trying my patience right now. I ain't gonna even lie. I know you guys saw that. I, I know you guys saw me hot route that, that out route. And it was wide open. I 100% hit B. So that 100% should have been a dot. But, hey, you know what? If, if that's what EA wanna do, that's what EA wanna do. You know what I'm saying? He's still going to dial up. That's it. 
All right, Joker Friend, we had to settle for three. I just needed the lead right now. Once again, we, we already know what time it is. We, we know what he's looking to do. Again, it, it's just taking it away. If we can take it away, we'll, we'll be sitting pretty. That's all we need to do. Just take it away. Delay fade. I didn't think he was going to do it on this side. That's on me. That's on me. That's completely on me. Yep. Take it away. Take it away. Take it away. I'm here. Let's go, Rod. Come on, baby. We know what he wants to do. Get him out. Get him out of here, man. We knew what he wanted to do, bro. I'm calling it out, man. Let's go. All right, Joker fam. So there you guys go. Two good game plays with no fly zone. Corey Littleton on the team. Again, like I said, I will be putting him on my God squad. He'll just be doing something a little bit differently, obviously, than sitting in a box. But I think he performed very well. Again, usering with him, obviously using with any linebacker, it's kind of, it's a little weird. They kind of, they move kind of boxy, like tanky a little bit. But you can still, you know what I'm saying? You can still take stuff away. You can get picks. I did it in my first gameplay. So, you know, but again, it, you might need Lurker on him. So it just depends. But I think with his zone and the fact, like I said, that he can get mid-zone knockout for 1 AP, I could definitely see him starting for the Raiders theme team and not only Raiders theme team, for my main team also. Again, guys, when you're playing these guys that like to have one step ahead and just want to sit in man coverage and do all this little weird stuff, you can still pass against people who have one step ahead. It gets kind of tricky if you're going against people with one step ahead in Acrobat because, you know, they can animate just about whenever EA feels like having them animate. But if you're just going against people with one step ahead, it's really easy to beat it when you know what you're looking for. But for me personally, as you guys can see, I'm perfectly fine with running no one step aheads and just using my brain to pick up on your tendencies and what you're looking for and what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? Which is why he got shut down in the fourth quarter and he had to quit. You know what I'm saying? I don't need one step ahead to beat somebody with my no-fly zone. You know what I'm saying? So, ultimately, guys, that's Corey Littleton. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. If so, make sure you guys drop some likes on my like button. Subscribe to the channel. Joker family support always means a lot. Till the next one, guys. Peace.